the funniest part of all of this was that I was in the winter analyst role during the recruiting process for the summer. So I got to see on the inside of, you know, this investment banking recruiting machine and watch how it happened. Um, and at the same time, they didn't say anything about the summer. So I was like going down to the lobby to like get on a credit Suisse first round and like, you know, talk about why I'm interested in that bank. Um, and so <laughs> I was going through all these other processes and all of a sudden it reached this awkward point where um, I hadn't heard anything from Morgan Stanley about the summer. And I had two super days in New York for other banks. And I was like, Hey, I like, I need to take a day off. And they're like, what are you talking about? This is an investment internship. You don't take a day off. Mm -hmm. And I was like, well, I, and I talked to the associate that I was close with at the time. And it's like, yeah. I've, I've got super days at other banks and like, I don't know what's the deal for the summer. And so like very quickly the MD um, that I worked a lot with, like con conferred with the other MDs and they like very quickly like, gave me a summer offer and just like, you can't go to New York. We need you working. <laughs> um, <laughs> But yeah, I got to be there while we were interviewing for the Chicago office and see, like, I legitimately was sifting through resumes and filtering who should be in the, you know, the short list. So like one of the big, like, realizations for me, was just how imperfect and human this process is. Mm -hmm. And the fact that I think a lot of students early on think that they're, you know, going to get this careful evaluation of whether or not they're a good fit. and it's really no, like, can you catch the attention of someone on that boat because it is leaving the harbor and <laughs> you need them to toss your life best, you know? Yeah.